thought it liked action. A couple of days on the lam, you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess it. I guess folks missed them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> what the party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> oh, I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around, wait for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. You sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como O'Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah. Not the same How's it going, Code Breakers? Broken Code here, and welcome back Southwest, to another installment right, of Red Dead Redemption yeah. 2. He said, "Follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake." Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their planet. Now, when we last left off, I had a fucked up mic and everything, and I didn't want to record until I got my mic fixed. And now that my mic's fixed, let's have some fun playing this game. That's a bad fucking sound. What's that? Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. That's in horse tracks. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. That way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you would hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him. People you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. Damn, y'all niggas is really out here for blood. I'll try to settle this like the old peaceful way, Let's I guess. Let's here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Squid, just gotta enjoy this. You two, hold position here. Let's go. The amount of time and detail put into this game is amazing.
The hills have eyes. Bruh. Look at this dude. Bruh. Look at this dude. <laughs> Look at this dude. Look look at his shoes. What type of horse is that? What's he doing? What you going in that horse for? Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Oh. Oh, he got slapped. Oh. He must be a pimp because he just made you his bitch. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Alright then. Let's have at it. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. I won't forget to grab that rifle from my horse. <laughs> you boys have to pick them off from Excuse up me? there. You got it, Dutch. Ah. Yeah. Good. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Yes, Our yes I have. Right now, our supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including coal. Wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Slow moving now. Uh. Ah. Flashy jump cut in three, two, one. Oh, watch out. We're back. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Huh. Stay low. Come on. Yes. Follow me. Get in cover, Arthur. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. We have to move on this right now. Why am I moving out like this? Okay, fine. See again. You make the move.
Daddy. Man, I had a dollar and 18 cents on him. Of course not. Paul doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun, ride a horse, and kill without thought, you're in. <laughs> Think how long some of you have been with me. I imagine Cole doesn't even know half the names of these fools. Where did that guy come from? Heads up, boys! We got more coming in from the forest! Ah, shit. Let's tear this place apart. Bill, go search that wagon there. Come on, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. That's a cigar. Give it to the chiefs to have a little bit of a smoke. Crackers, canned vegetables. A cigar. What's in this chest? That's money. Hey, Let me get some of that dynamite. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. So you're just a terrorist now, okay? Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. 
of Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. Keep the shit moving. All right, let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Not a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and out. They can pummel us as hard as they like, but we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, he didn't get combed, but this hit will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. Big bet. Big bet. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Ha! Huh. Hmm. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Cone? Wait a minute. Leave him to Ooh, me. Him? All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay, you got it. Let's get him. You got a fast horse there, buddy. It would be a shame if, um, you know, I caught you. Don't what? What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't what do you know mean you don't name? know your name? It's Karen. Karen what? Duffy. Karen Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Karen Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please. Mm. I feel bad for you, Karen Duffy. You about to get messed up. We don't like the no Driscolls out here. Come on, Mister, P -p please. Ain't no pleading. Might turn you into glue like old Bessie here. Let me go. I'll disappear. I'll go to Mexico. You, you might. Shut your mouth, you little shitter. I will shut it for you. This is some nice aesthetics. Even though I can't see where the fuck I'm going. Please, I'll do anything. I don't want to die, mister. I have a heart, mister. I don't give a fuck about your heart. to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones. Two bones right there. <laughs> Yeah, that nigga, that's how you make niggas shut up in the wild west. 
telling me you're gonna break every bone in their body. They keep talking. Nick said, okay, twice. Oh, now we gotta break two bones. You don't play games out here. I feel kind of, feel kind of bad about him, but you know, <laughs> it don't, it do not matter. Blows your vert. <laughs> Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. I mean, I'm not gonna hurt you, but I'm pretty sure they are. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <coughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. And on that note, I'm going to end the video here. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and as always, goodbye and good luck.